Hello everybody, Robert Rambles here, and welcome to another episode of World of Warcraft Battle for Azeroth. We are leveling quickly in 2020, and now we're doing Scarlet Halls, so welcome. Welcome to Scarlet Halls, everyone. Let's grab these quests. What would you ask of death? Are we in the library? Or the armory? Remember. It's just the Scarlet Halls. It's not the armory. It's not the library. Okay. Uh, fair enough. You know, I really wanted to change specs before coming in here, but these guys, obviously, in the spirit of leveling quickly, my random group has begun to pull quickly. Let's see. I probably shouldn't even mess with this right now, right? Archers, attack! Oop. Another down! Can we grab this? Let none escape. Apparently only one person can grab it. Let's get up here with him. Another down. Do not relent. Another down. Do not relent. Let's pop our prismatic barrier just in case. Oh no. <laughs> uh, we got knocked back into the fire. Look at that. Look how close we spawn. That's right. You don't even spawn outside. Unfortunately, we didn't get credit for most of those uh, Crusaders they killed. That guy counted as a Crusader. I'm pretty sure, though, he was like a mini-boss. Alright. I have a feeling that Frost is probably better AoE damage, but I don't have time to learn all the spells right now, so... Ah, fresh meat for the dogs. Release the hounds! Release the hounds! Am I supposed to switch my targeting to the hounds Release now? Release the hounds! Yeah, no. it looks like it. I'll put you down after I kill these weaklings. What a jerk. I don't think I've ever listened to these voice lines. I bleed. <laughs> but I won't die. Incorrect. No, stop. Obey your master. A fitting end to Houndmaster Brawn. We looted a bunch of shit, but, uh, nothing good. Who do we have in our group anyway? We have a Worgen Rogue, a Lightforge Draenei Paladin tanking, we have a Draenei, Lightforge Draenei Hunter, and a Void Elf Priest. Very diverse group. These people are probably all like, why the hell is this guy arcane explosioning? Why isn't he frost? Right? I have to assume that's what they're thinking, you know. And they probably have DPS meters installed, so they're probably just seeing like how bad we are. It's all good. It seems like it's all part of his plan. Let's just run with the tank, shall we? Alright, another boss. Our master. Arms master Harlan. Another chance to test my might. That takes so long to wind up, I wonder if it's just better to spam arcade missiles unless we're out of mana. Calls on two of his allies to join the fight. 
I don't know what his allies are doing. They're taking the scenic route. You need more training. There he goes. I know he was going to do some kind of blade whirl. Oh, well, I thought he would stay alive for a minute and maybe actually try to hit us, but I guess not. Uh, yeah, we could use a neck <laughs> and a ring and some gloves. We need some loot, guys. Not really, because we're leveling so fast that it's going to render itself useless pretty quickly, but we could still use some. Oh, you know what? Arcane Explosion powers up uh, Arcane Barrage. It gives us Arcane Power, and I hadn't noticed that before. Well, that's a game changer. I like that. I think four or more and we could AoE. We just have to remember to switch back and fire off that uh, powered up Arcane Blast Barrage. Oh, he's going. Oh, we got uh, shocked. Alright, well, we went through quite a bit of mana, but that's not exactly an issue for us. Where'd the food go exactly? That's another question entirely. Very unusual. Everything must burn. Let's try that again. All the Scarlet Crusades, you too shall be charged. Quash. Gonna have to worry about it once we clear out our inventory. I don't want to get hit by that. What happens when we get like days into it? We die, I guess. Interrupted. Oh, uh, we got slow. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Action bars are locked again for no good reason. Didn't tell those to lock. We got the Codex of the Crusade to complete the quest. Have a hooded crusader who's walked in here. Alright, we'll turn all of our quests into her, hopefully. Victory for Silvana. Alright, and that took like what, a few moments? Maybe. Did we even complete everything? Yeah, we definitely did. Uh, let's go ahead and we'll leave the group. Thanks for the run, all. And so that was Scarlet Halls in minutes. Those lower level dungeons, with all the power ramp up, it's... I don't know that it's enjoyable. It's easy experience, but uh, besides that... See you soon. I remember like years ago, you, you'd run a lot of dungeons while leveling, but they weren't that easy. They were easier than they were in Classic and Burning Crusade, but... I think I'm thinking more of like the Wrath era of leveling dungeon difficulty. Because that kind of stuff, I feel like one of us could have cleared that on our own, like if we were semi-careful. Uh, let's get all these turned in. 
And uh, what do we got? Shatter Spear Invaders. 50 Scavenging Grey Mist Murlocs. There has to be a catch to that. 50. How would we take out 50? Would we have some kind of item or something? I am not entirely sure. Let's go out and check out this other one. Actually, do we need to empty our bags? I know that we do. Peace be with you. Um, yeah, we can do that since we Feel haven't already. Oh, she doesn't sell anything. <laughs> I'm waiting to Feel be able to open her menu, but she doesn't even sell anything, so... We need to open that. Alright, yeah, basically we're, we're selling everything because uh, none of it matters. Oh, perfect! Hey, we needed a neck. And we got a neck. Not from a boss drop, but from the loot bag that you get when you complete the random dungeon. Alright, we were leaving. We were on our way to the Shatter Spear Invaders. Report to Lieutenant Mora Starbreeze at the Ruins of Mathristra. So obviously saying totally correctly. Corrupted Thistle Bear that doesn't care about us. He's not corrupted enough to be aggressive, apparently. He's corrupted enough to kill random wildlife and then not even eat it. Alright, let's see. How many quests do you have for us? Hopefully many. Can I assist you? No, but you can give us a quest. Goodbye. Um, oh, clicked on the wrong what purple night elf. Okay, two quests. We need to slay some Shatter Spear laborers, ten of them to be precise, and find eight highborn relics. The relics, I'm assuming, are going to be on the ground. So, let's go. Oh, you know what we could do now? I, I do want to check out the other specs. I, I don't see why the heck not. They're probably all going to be as overtuned with the gear that we have on. Uh, so we're going to need Frostbolt, Ice Lance, Fingers of Frost is passive, 15% chance. Frostbolt has a 15% chance and Frozen Orb has a 10% chance to grant the charge of Fingers of Frost, okay. Flurry, probably want that out here. Unleash a Flurry of Ice, striking the target three times for a total of 159 Frost. Is this... Is this Arcane Missiles the ice version? While Brain Freeze is active, Flurry applies Winter's Chill, causing your target to take damage from your spells as if it were frozen. Uh, Water Elemental? Okay, I guess we get this. My action bars are locked. God damn. Look at that. I don't really know how I've ever felt about pets in World of Warcraft. They often have a tendency to crowd your character. And just make everything kind of like, it breaks immersion for me and I don't really care for it. Hunter pets are okay. But we'll, we'll see. It depends on the pet. This guy is pretty small. So maybe he like, won't crowd me. Uh, we have Ice Barrier. Which we could put on our bar. Counter spell needs to go back on where it was. Sheep, as if we're ever going to use that. I just gotta fix this now. Uh, I always have this off, so it baffles me when it gets turned on. Uh, we're never going to use that. Let's be let's be fair. Remove curse. Okay, sure, maybe someday. Uh, you can go up here because you stay out permanently. That's right. Now, where the hell was all of our food going? Okay. It's showing up now, but I swear it was not, uh, it was not showing up previously. Look at that, it puts it on cooldown. Interesting. Passive, passive, teleport. Okay. 
All right, yeah, this looks like it's going to be basically just as simple. Let's see if uh, Flurry is actually Arcane Missiles. No, it's a, it's a cast. Okay. And then it shoots three. I got it. Um, well, this is actually like a little slower than Arcane was. Let's just try something a little different. Yeah, I wonder what I need to be opening with here. Probably that, I guess. Hmm. Doesn't quite seem as powerful as Arcane. All we had to do as Arcane was just Arcane Missiles. Why would I want to be doing this? What impetus do I have to want to try harder to achieve the same result? Yeah, I don't know about this. It could be that I'm just doing something entirely wrong, but all of our spells seem to do like... Yeah, see, I need more procs like that. Like, whatever that was would probably help us out. Let's stick with it for this quest and just, uh... See what happens. Yeah, I'm not digging it. I don't know why I would want to do this. What benefit does this have? Yeah, screw that. Unless I'm doing something terribly off here or miss like an entire spell, which I don't think I have. Did we not have our water elemental out? Was he not doing anything? Is it was that part of the problem? It could have been, but guys, listen, if I can just cast one spell. And maybe follow it up with an in look at this shit. Like if I can just do this, why would I why would I do anything else? Do you know what I mean? I don't need to have a pet. I don't need to balance procs. Like I have my clear casting and that's just like a bonus. I don't even have to really pay attention to that, so this is um this is the way to go. If you're trying to level quickly, you're probably gonna want to do something more like this. A reason to worry. Bring the Shatter Spear orders to Lieutenant Mora Starbreeze. Yeah, okay, we'll be going back there after this quest anyway. So that can definitely wait. I love the mounts. That's, that's a really cool mount, actually. It's a rat mount, but I still think it's incredibly unique. It startled me. It was so unique. I did not know what it was out of the corner of my eye for a moment. Alright, we've got all the laborers. We've been slacking on the relics, I guess. And because of that, we're probably going to have to kill more laborers than we would otherwise need to. But it's okay, because arcane missiles kills them so easily. Uh, I'm actually glad we didn't switch for that dungeon, because I probably would have been doing shit damage and not have even known it. Not that we, we were contributing a lot anyway, but, you know. All right, is he standing by a relic? It's hard to tell. Nope. Okay, let's get out of this little kill box that we're in and um, maybe find some more relics. Oh, hello there. Hi, right, just hang out there for one second. I forgot that we have that uh, talent that we can move while casting missiles if we have clear casting up for it. I'm out of range. You're out of range, I know buddy. Not really useful, but uh, fun to play around with I guess. Uh, two more relics. Do you, you do have a target. Alright, still need a couple more relics. See them. I'm sure I just wasn't paying attention when I was messing around with the frost spec. That seems like something my limited brain capacity would result in. Because uh, we cleared this out and I just didn't grab these, right? 
Fair enough, they were still here and the respawn rate didn't uh, force us to annihilate those guys a second time with a different form of magic. And I am now remembering that I have a mount. Obviously you've been playing more classic than anything else recently. Hello. Del Nagi. Greetings. I am honored. Goddess watch over you. Hello. Good luck, friend. Alright, so I'm, I'm still kind of ignoring this. I think there's like a vehicle or something involved. Um, but that's fine. We will do it eventually. Probably. Most likely. We're already level 33, so... We, we could technically leave here at any time and go to any other zone. And if you get bored of an area, like aesthetically, especially if you're leveling this way where you're not really paying attention to the quests, uh, because as I've said, honestly, why would you really care about these quests coming in? Even as a new player, this is stuff that was from the Cataclysm expansion that happened about 10 years ago. Uh, none of it's relevant to anything going on in World of Warcraft today unless you really dig for those nuggets of lore that are consistent. And you're better off just... Uh, Checking out Noble's channel if you're really into the lore of the Cataclysm or things like that. Uh, we've run through a horde encampment here. I'm definitely positive this was the way we were supposed to go. I'm going to try to get clear enough of all of this jazz uh, that we can drop aggro. Like, even if that means we end up parking, like, right here. What level are... These guys are good. We can fight them. I was kind of worried that they were, like, PvP flagged or something, but they're not... Alright, so we need to slay them, Mystics and Enforcers. We need 12 Shatter Spear Armaments burned. Armaments. Are they going to be these boxes? Oh, we don't even lay a template. We stand near the boxes and we clicky the thing. How much of a range do- oh, quite a bit of a range. Perfect, okay. feel like, uh... Sounds a little quiet today. Yeah, I apologize for that, guys. I heard the music going on in the background, and I'm like, damn, that music is pretty cool. And then I realized we could barely hear it. Yeah, let's keep it up, you know. We're leveling quickly. It's important to uh, have some good music, some good ambience. Probably I'd recommend, like, just a chill soundtrack. Just if you're trying just to sit for hours at a time and do this. You probably won't keep the in-game sound on for too long because it'll it kind of gets repetitive. It'll burn in your brain. I've I've had sessions in my early twenties where we would play for six or seven hours straight. I'm not proud of it, but it, it happened. Um, and so yeah, the game sounds would start to kind of burn their way into your brain after a while. Best to have on like something mellow and enjoyable. Especially with the state of things now, like, there's no danger. Back in the day, you kind of had to listen for noises of mobs aggroing and stuff like that. Uh, you don't have to worry about that now. Even if you get jumped, it's, you're easily, it's easily recoverable. That was a nice charge. Martoran buddy here. Out of range. I just wanted to make sure we couldn't like tap it again and again to get the same boxes. Who knows? A lot of line of sight, except I can see them. <laughs> I could still see them quite clearly. Let's. Uh, we're gonna have to take this guy out first. Six out of six. Toss this fire up here, I'm sure. Oh, toss it that way. Can it's we hit the... Far away. No, we can't hit the far one. Uh, there we go. We've only killed one mystic so far? Okay, we need to hunt some mystics, guys.
What zone do you guys want to see next? We could, we could basically go anywhere. Um, almost. It's it's all level like well the highest ones are level 40 to 60 so once we like get to level 40 we'll be able to go anywhere in the old world essentially that wasn't a part of the cataclysm expansion so let me know a zone you'd like to see I I don't know how many zones in the old world we're gonna get to see if we level like this but uh, I'd be willing to take any suggestions you guys have and that I'll choose one I need to get closer. or if there's like an overwhelming consensus or overwhelming thumbs up on somebody's suggestion then that's where we'll go so yeah let me know what you would like to see as we level quickly I was thinking when we get to like one of the expansions like we could either do probably all of Wrath of Lich King or all of Mr. Pandaria if we're talking about getting us from level 67 to level 80 uh, then again Pandaria, there it is. Okay, so Pandaria is level 80 to 90, so what we'll do... I think the choice is between Outlands and Northrend. So yeah, we're definitely going to go to Northrend. I'd love to go to Northrend and actually read the quest. Um, Wrath of the Lich King was kind of like some of my fondest memories of, of World of Warcraft. I mean, I started playing in vanilla, I got really into the game in Burning Crusade. What brings you here? But Wrath of the Lich King was when I started to like actually raid. And oh boy, was it a great time! Be careful. And yeah, I had like it's too far away. so many classes at max level in that expansion, uh, except for the rogue and the warlock. I think were the only classes I didn't get to 80 during Wrath of the Lich King. Uh, that guy was easy enough. I don't think he even thought about doing much of anything to us. We have a key. Still need a couple more mystics. This is our last box. I wonder what the key was for. We don't seem to need it to do anything. That's a little unusual. Shatter Spear Torturer's Cage Key. Maybe from a quest that got changed or rewritten? I don't know. I do know we need more mystics. Gonna have to mount up to look for them. It's pretty intense. Okay, well. Down here we have laborers and warriors. Not seeing mystics, however. Let's check out down here. This is where we ran through and just like ignored them all, so maybe there were some back here. I see lots of enforcers, um, and some laborers, but here's a mystic. Shit, let's, let's get it together. Alright, we just need one more mystic. Overseers, laborers, the mystics are probably not going to be out here like chopping stone or mining stone or whatever the hell's going on out here. They're probably going to be chilling back in their huts, away from the problems, or just taking a casual walk through their neighborhood when they get blasted. Alright, six out of six, let's get out of here. <laughs> shit. So he stunned us, uh, but he didn't dismount us, and therefore he gets to live. I know, we pulled like half of the mining camp just trying to get here. Let's see how far we have to run to get them to de-aggro. 
they're shooting at him. <laughs> oh man, so many so many camp NPCs are useless. So many times in World of Warcraft, will you, I, I drag monsters back into a camp only to have all the NPCs just kind of stare at you as you get annihilated. Like, come on guys. But these guys actually helped us. That's a big change. Farewell. How may I help? Ishn voila. All right, guys, I think we are going to take a break here. We're going to have some more things to do if we want to do them here. But I would be really keen to maybe check out going somewhere else. So thinking about the Alliance Old World areas during the Cataclysm, uh, what zone would you like to see? Let me know. And take care of yourselves out there. Be well. And I hope we'll see you again soon. Bye now.